Alright, what's up everyone? Today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to wheelie in MX bikes for beginners mostly that don't yet uh, know how to wheelie. Uh, I'm not really a bike life guy, I ride mostly motocross on this game, but I mean I can also wheelie like easily as you can see. Had a knee knocker. So yeah, so first step is go to settings or settings and well this is what I use so you can uh, copy this if you like but it's mostly pr preference but this is what I use and I found this best at motocross and bike life so once you got your settings dialed in everything good then you need to download the track I'm gonna leave the links of uh, some good bike life tracks in the description and the second step is the bike um, a 250F would be kind of perfect for learning because this one, uh, this two-stroke 250 is, it doesn't really have low-end power, like, you see it dies out, which the four-stroke doesn't die out, so. I would say get a 250F if you're just starting out, and stay in second gear, I would say, 250. Then try to just kind of pop it up, and then just put in the back brake. Because you have to learn the back brake once you, because most people just kind of pop it up. And then they just loop like that. So always have your finger on the brake and uh, try to mess around with that. You could just throttle it up like this. But I found it best to clutch it up. Especially if it's a uh, 250, it's not, it doesn't really have that much power. So if you stay neutral, lean a bit forward. And as you lean back, you pop the clutch. So it will look something like this. Lean forward, gas it up, pop the clutch. And then you got it up. So that's the first step. Second step is, uh, well, yeah, just learn the back brake. And this comes really with practice, like, you won't get this on your first time. I had to do this about, like, 30 to 20 hours to fully learn how to, like, wheelie, swerve, and stuff like that. Oh, that was a bad example. <laughs> just practice and don't give up. And also with leaning, it's you don't really use the lean when you wheel like this. I don't really recommend it. I just think you see it forward and back to like to pop it up, and then just stay back the whole time. Just lean back. You see, I'm leaning back the whole time. It will be kind of easier because if you don't lean, I'm gonna show you. If you do this, your whole body kind of like jerks if you don't lean, and it becomes kind of harder to wheelie. So I would stay lean back like this. Just practice. So yeah, there's nothing really special to learning wheelies. Really. So it's just you have to practice. Use the first tips I said, like learn the brake, throttle control. Also, I say when you're starting, don't really be choppy. Like don't don't try to like chop it the whole time. Try to kind of be smooth. Like I mean, this is a two-stroke, so it. I mean, I can still try. Like, be smooth, like something like this. No, uh, you can't really be smooth on a two stroke, but on a four stroke 250F, you can be smooth, but on a two stroke, you just kind of like have to blip it like this. It doesn't really say much if you either blip it or do it smoothly. I've seen people do, do them both ways. Find what's more comfortable for you and stick to that and practice, yeah. That's what I gotta say, so. Oh, and if you, you wanna do knee knockers, like, say you learned wheeling and you wanna do a knee knocker like this. I've seen many people asking this, so what you have to do is go to your settings. You go to input 2 and you see this trick and put it on whatever you like so because this is gonna toggle the the knee knocker so you press it and the knee knocker I can show you so right here pop it up and then I press the button and boom I'm doing a knee knocker so yeah it's that easy you don't have to do any mods or nothing you just have to change that setting so yeah comment down below if you want uh, some more tips or anything like that and uh, yeah I can happy to help so Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.